I noticed a statement emanating from the government today complaining about my comments at Babujan, where I said that people after March 21st should chase them out of their communities. Let me make it clear, I stand by that statement. I've made it clear at Babujan that we are a party that does not believe in violence. We're not going to be burning people's buildings. We're not going to be beating people on the streets. But the government would become illegal after March 21st. And therefore, they would no longer be ministers. When they come to the communities, whether it is in Burbies or Essequibo or in Linden or in South Georgetown or Agricola or in Enmore or Port Morant, the people of Guyana should treat them as illegal. I said they should walk behind them, chase them out of your communities because it means they've been squatting on, in power and that they will be there unconstitutionally. I made it clear whoever they are, every minister of the government, including President Granger and Prime Minister Nagamoto, because they no longer have the the right to hold those titles anymore. And so I think that they're desperate, they're worried about it, how people will treat them after March 21st, the deserved treatment that they will get after March 21st. And that's not the end of it all, because there'll be much more that will happen. If they think they can continue to stay in power, disrespect our constitution with impunity, and act as in a normal fashion. Well, they have another thing coming. So I reiterate to the people of Ghana, across Ghana, people of every race and every religion should join us in a movement to chase them out of their, the communities that they come to. Thank you.